it's time for the Dollar Tree train fall and Halloween haul. I don't much do Halloween, so I got mostly fall stuff. I put on my falliest looking shirt. It's over my sundress because <laughs> it's <laughs> definitely not long sleeve weather. It's 105 or 6 or something today, so I just threw this on for the video. <laughs> Alrighty, so we're, the way that Dollar Tree train thing works is there's 14 of us this time, I think, unless somebody has to drop out for some reason. Um, we each buy 10 items at Dollar Tree, and then everybody has to have some kind of prize. I'm going to do a $10 gift card for Dollar Tree. And um, you have to comment, even if you don't want what they're giving away, you still have to comment so that we, that's the only way we can see that you're subscribed to everybody. And that's another rule is you have to be subscribed to everybody. And the reason we have to, you have to comment is because YouTube's changed their way they do things and there's no way to look up if you're subscribed to somebody other than from your comment. So that's why we ask you to comment even if you don't want to enter that particular video or giveaway, I mean. But you can enter all 14, but you can only win one to make it more fair for everybody. <laughs> and my rules, my personal rules are you must live in the continental United States because I can't afford the, the postage to other places. <laughs> um, YouTube doesn't have anything to do with this. You know, I bought, I'm buying the card with my own money. Um, don't have to worry about, you know, if it gets lost in the mail, I, you know, once I turn over the post office, hopefully it won't get lost. In, well, I'll, I'll just put a stamp on it and mail it. So hopefully it won't get lost in the mail because I'm not going to do a tracking on a, a, a card, you know. And usually I say something about, you know, if you're allergic to stuff, be sure and pre-test it and all that. But I don't have to say that because it's a gift card. <laughs> um, I think that's all the rules. I'll put all the usual rules down below in the comments. And um, it, on everybody's video that you watch, comment. It's not like whose is better than whose. It's just of the 10 things I got. How'd you like them? Would you use those? You know, so say I've got two things. You're like, I'm not putting that in my house. Well, then you wouldn't give me a 10. You'd give me maybe a seven or an eight. <laughs> so that's kind of how that's going to work. So, alrighty, I bought two signs. Dollar Tree is great for their signs. This one says, cool autumn breezes, sweater weather, hello fall. And it's got a stake where I can put it in the ground out front. Thought it was cute. And then the other one, I'll probably prop it up against something. I don't know. Nothing more pleasing than pumpkin season. <laughs> I love pumpkin spiced tea and stuff like that. All right, now I got two bags of stuff here. So that's number one and number two. And I got a couple of, I got three pumpkins. And I didn't realize till I got these home, I was caught on something here. No, that's not for you, nosy little boy, but these light up. Let's see, how does this go? It's not working. Maybe they need a battery. Maybe you take this off and you have to put a battery in it. Well, maybe it is lighting up. I can't really tell in the daylight. <laughs> but they've got like a little candle thing in there that's supposed to light up. I don't know if there's a... I'll have to play with this more, whether you have to... Maybe you have to put a battery in it. It's got like a little door, I think. So you probably have to put a battery in it. So I got a purple one. And I got a orange one. They have black too, but I'm not into the whole Halloween thing. I'm more into the, these do have a little black netting on them, but. And then I got a couple more pumpkins. 
These will probably be, these will probably go by my TV. And then these will probably go on my tablescape. And there's these two, like this one's, if you can see, see it's, and then this one's burlap. And then I got these to put on my tablescape. They're little sparkly leaves. So that's one, two, three, four, five. So now we're up to seven. And then the rest must be in this other bag. <laughs> this is for more for my tablescape. I got floral pick thing with some chrysanthemums. These may go on the table or they may go outside and pretend to be something I'm growing. <laughs> so I got two of those. So that's seven, eight, nine. So I got 11, I guess. <laughs> so I got this one. So that makes 10. And then I bought this too. So I guess I got 11 by mistake. These will probably go, I don't know where, out in the yard maybe, or on the table in with these maybe. I don't know, well, I'll decide. Once I get my house decorated, I'll um, show you show you my fall decorations. <clears throat> but anyway, that is my um, 10 items. So what do you think? How did you like them? I uh, hope you enjoy this uh, Dollar Tree train we're doing. <clears throat> Excuse me. Got a bunch of drainage, I'm hoping. I got exposed to COVID, but I think it's just allergies. I'm on day five and I'm not really sick, so I'm hoping I don't get it. I did, did, did buy a test kit from Amazon, have it delivered just in case. But I'll probably test tomorrow night. It's Friday today, and I'll probably test tomorrow night before I go to church on Sun Saturday. Let's see. Um, let me see. I forget. I looked it up, and now I forget, and i got to look it up again <laughs> when this starts. I, it's September 8th, I think, but I'm not 100% sure, so let's double check. Um where is there it is instagram we have an instagram group that gives all the rules and stuff for this okay um the collab will upload on september 8th beginning at 2 p.m staggered every 15 minutes <clears throat> we're gonna try and keep the videos under 12 minutes i'm at eight so i'm doing good um and then it'll end on the 22nd so that's two weeks, basically. So watch for this. Well, you're watching it. I was going to say, watch for this, but you're already watching it. <laughs> there will be a, sometime before this comes out, there will have been a little watch for this kind of uh, little, short little video like we always do. Tracy from Tracy and Chloe, um, they, she always does all our, like, um, intros and, and, um, or, um, thumbnails and all that kind of stuff. So she's real good at all that stuff. So anyway, that is it. I don't want to go over the 12 minutes. So let me know how you think I did. One to, one to 10. Not going to hurt my feelings if you don't like what I got. <laughs> um, it's not really Halloween-y because I don't really, I never really much liked Halloween. I always felt like you're sending your kids out in the cold to beg for something you don't want them to have. I mean, I did let them go trick-or-treat, and I just didn't like it much. And now that I don't have kids anymore at home, I don't have to participate. <laughs> <coughs> Excuse me, all that drainage. Um, a lot of times, like sometimes I'll sit out front with a bowl of candy and give it out. Sometimes if I just put it on, on my... Um, porch, you know, on a chair or something, let people help themselves, but the dog goes ballistic, so I don't know. I, this guy, I haven't had him for Halloween yet, so I'm trying to decide what to do with him. 
whether to take him somewhere or just let him go crazy or maybe take him out front with me and let him see the kids and hopefully he won't bark at them and scare them off from getting the candy. I'm not sure what I'm going to do this Halloween. <laughs> I might just not, not participate and just go somewhere. And if he goes crazy, he goes crazy and I'm not there so I don't have to listen to it. Speaking of which, going crazy. Hey, Daddy. Talk to you soon. Let me know. Oh, let me get it. Ugh.